Monday here at the New England Motorcycle Museum, and uh, you, may, you may or may not know Mark, he's on the board of directors for the museum, he's been volunteering here for a couple of years now, he's busted his ass, and as a token of our appreciation, as a gift, we're giving him this Honda Reflex 250 scooter, so thank you for all your service and help here, Mark. Excellent. Grateful. Mark, Mark is not only on the board of directors, but he's like family now, he's uh, opened up so many doors, so many opportunities, he got us with the uh, Yukon, he got some support from Yukon, and a lot of support from the town, and he's been... The, uh, he got Mayor Scott, uh, no, Senator Scott Franz to come down here to the museum and loan his Captain America bike here and also made a sizable donation to the museum. So Mark's been busting his butt, making stuff happen for the museum. He's the guy behind the scenes that's uh, keeping us all together and uh, keeping things coordinated here. So this is a Honda Helix, or excuse me, Honda Reflex sc scooter, but it's actually a 250cc motorcycle disguised as a scooter. And um, it's, uh, Check this out, come here. The speedometer, look at the speedometer on this thing. It goes to 100 miles per hour. Uh, it's got the uh, clock on there, it's got a tachometer, it's got a uh, gas gauge, um, <laughs> typical Honda quality, 3,600 miles on it. it uh, it's in beautiful shape, and um, Mark's gonna be ripping around on it this summer, so you gotta get your colors next. There we go. Colors. So we're gonna pull it outside, and uh, Mark's gonna go on his maiden voyage on this today, so. Thank you, Mark. We appreciate all your hard work and uh, all your support. Junior, as you know, we're gifting this to Mark as a token of our appreciation. So thank you. There uh, we go. It's guys like this that are making America great again. That's right. Together, guys, just take on a plan, have an idea, and just run with it, man. All of us together can actually change. Uh, everyone thinks you need to be a gazillionaire, the big politicians, and change starts right, right from the heart, right in your own community. Um, you see blight, clean it up, make a difference. You see somebody struggling, help them out. You know, charity begins at home, and we all need to get back to the old saying, I am my brother's keeper. And guys, if we can form together and find some common bound, anything's possible. Just look at this museum, what we did. You know, it's just turning Rockville into the beacon of hope that it once was and what it will be. And guys, you haven't seen anything yet. We got big stuff coming down the pipe, hopefully, uh, next spring will be a lot different. And thanks, guys. Come on down. Stay tuned. There's a lot of stuff we're working on that we can't, uh, we don't like to, throughout my career, I would never talk about something that's happening until it actually happened in, in the computer industry uh, for 20 years. But there's a lot of big things brewing that are going to be awesome for the museum and for Rockville and for Connecticut and also the motorcycle industry as a whole. We're going to put Rockville on the map and we're gonna put the motorcycle industry in the limelight in a great way, so stay tuned. It's guys like this behind the scene that are making it all possible. Mayor Dan, uh, Senator Dan Champagne, uh, some of the other senators like Scott Franz and uh, Tim Acker, there's been some great support for the museum uh, that we're uh, hoping will, we'll, uh, together we'll rise to the top. We're going to make it happen, so stay tuned and God bless America.